Okay, so this is my initial review of the Racer Star brushless motor. Um, I was provided these uh, courtesy of Banggood, and these are the 2204-2300KV. Um, and this is exactly how it came in uh, from Banggood. Let's take a look inside. So each motor comes with uh, some screws. Okay, so you have your um, counterclockwise nut and clockwise nut for each motor. You have a let's see bag of three millimeter screws. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. It looks like there's six of them in there. Um, I will be installing this um, on a Nighthawk Pro 170 build that I'm doing next. Um, there's something to point out is if you look closely at these motors, um, there are directions on them. So um, it's kind of cool. It tells you uh, which motor or which way it should be rotating. Um, it does have these clips on the bottom that I'm not too uh, too thrilled with, not a fan of. Um, on certain on certain builds, you you have to watch out because these are a little bit bigger. Um, a little bit bigger and therefore it's rubbing on the the inner circle of the frame. Um, give you, let me see if I can show you what I mean. Uh, you probably can't really tell but this is, um, the spacing is for, on this frame, the spacing is for a 2204 motor and it looks, it fits just fine. However, if you look really close, the ring is rubbing against it. It's very, very, very tight fit in there. So, um, if that's the case, what I do recommend is you do shave um, the shave the hole down here just a little bit so that it clears. Otherwise, it's um, a, little, a little bit of a drag to it. I'm not too thrilled the way they have this particular uh, C-clip on these motors. I'd rather have either the flat kind of the washer C-clip. Um, or like a lock nut or something like that. So other than that, um, motors feel very smooth in the hand. Nothing good length wires. Um, it looks it looks always it looks okay. I don't really see any uh, defect. Looks pretty good. Um, I finished the build on a Nihil Pro and I've, this is my fourth pack and this time I'm running on 4S Multistar uh, 40C uh, 1.4. So... I'm just going to do some punch out. Um, it is pretty quick and very very responsive and it's probably because due to a beta flight on here um, but the motor seems to have no issues handling the 4S with uh, I believe these are 40-45 uh, tri-blades Gemstar and I'm going to do a quick uh, punch out right now Oh, it's pretty quick. So if you if you hear my radio in the background, I am testing the RSSI value as well. That's what you're hearing uh, for the receiver I have on there. It's an RX uh, 800 uh, high range receiver. So I get about, it looks like I get about five minutes and I'm flying pretty hard here. Um, and the motors are coming down 
cool. Not even warm to the touch at all. So the motors, are, like I said, so far just fantastic. And by the way, these are stock uh, two stock ratings on Betaflight 2.1, 2.9.1.